Whoa, 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 whoa. Before today's vlog starts, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to be traveling from Milan back to England. And yes, I always cut it close with flights. This one was genuinely no exception. So without further ado, before we get into that, enjoy this unboxing. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome your faces to a box with the batteries on it. Wow, yeah, I know, look at that, absolutely amazing. But as you'll see in today's vlog, I traveled back from Italy all the way to the UK and uh, almost missed my flight. So stay tuned for the rest of this vlog to enjoy it. But seeing as though this came out today, I thought, you know what? I might as well film it, put it in this vlog, and then tomorrow start fresh on the brand new phone. So welcome to the iPhone 11 Pro 512 gigabyte unboxing. The size, the size doesn't matter because no one's actually going to see it or anything like that. And I'm pretty sure I've, op I've already opened this box completely wrong. I would say we're professionals around here, but you know awesome. what? That's not a knife. This is a knife provided by my brother, Mac7. <laughs> very, very nice, Marquez. Thank you very much. So I did actually already film this bit of me unboxing it because I didn't want to stab it by accident. But um, ta-da! Ta look at that! Wow, it's probably... I know this is the most professional unboxing you've ever seen, but we're going to use this... American bayonet. <laughs> so, but first ever iPhone 11 unboxed with American bayonet. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here, it, oh, it is 512. Yeah, cool. Here is the 512 gigabyte iPhone 11 Pro. AirPods with lightning connector, USB-C, blah, 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 blah. Yeah. I'm not too sure, very, very nice. Yeah. Now, I'm gonna ask the question. I don't think it does. I think the, oh no, AirPods, I think that's just normal headphones, but we're gonna go for a little bit of peel on you ready? You ready for the peel pond? It's like my favorite thing. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's the, oh, that's the good good. Oh, that's the good good. Very nice sleek box, I must say. Half the time I don't really care, but I do actually indeed keep my boxes for my iPhones. And rather than trading in my old iPhones, I just keep them. I know you can back up all the data and stuff like that, but I keep them even give them to like friends and family and stuff like that if they want an upgrade from the last one. But here it is. The brand new fidget spinner iPhone 11. Looks a bit weird with the three lenses on it, but we, re we reveal said phone looking all beautiful. I'm go you know what? I don't mess around again with the peel palm. We're just going to take it straight off. Is this where I drop it? <laughs> is this where I seriously drop Go it? I'm just an idiot. <laughs> Co content. This, there is people with channels out there that just smash phones on day one, which um, I'm going to say is stupid. So leave a like rating if you hate that. Glass front feeling quite nice. Sides feel nice. It does feel heavier, even though I don't know whether it is the same weight as the last one. I, it can't be with the lenses, but it feels heavier, it feels a bit thicker. I think it's the exact same dimensions, but the back is actually really nice. It's like a satin, it's like a satin glass, like back to it, or like metal. Would you consider that's glass? Like, it's like a satin glass metal, right? Yeah, it's nice. It's like, like steely kind of yeah, yeah. feeling, isn't it? If, it? if it is steel, then it is steel. That actually looks like what my new bedroom's gonna be like. I'm just mm. spoiler alert. But yeah, this is the brand new phone, looking all good, looking everything. Three lenses, I think you've got super wide, Normal, video, all that portrait, so it's gonna come in handy. I'm just gonna slide that in there. Smash. And then uh, what comes in the box? This is the most typical thing ever. Designed by Apple in California. We have the, oh, now you get the bulky charger. I don't know because the, the new iPhone 11's got a better battery in it now. So because it's got a better battery, I don't know whether this is used for like, you, whoa, yeah. USB, USB-C fast, faster charging. So rather than using the USB now, we've got these plugs instead faster charging which you'll actually nice. see being used on like the iPad, uh, iPads and stuff like that which if uh, you've ever used an iPhone charger like the iPad charger with the iPhone that charges your phone so much quicker yeah. the math on that might not make sense but trust me from use it feels like it we've got the typical wired headphones still the fact that they're not giving out wireless headphones yet with the price of these phones like this phone not a flex in the slightest I had to do it because I film every day of my life with this thing um, 1,500 or something like that, 1,550 or something like that. Ridiculous. We've got an adapter, oh no, charger, USB-C to lightning, and then I believe that is everything inside the box. Another thing I'm gonna say is, does this come with the adapter still for the headphone? No, it just, it just goes straight into it. So now I don't actually think you get the, the dongle to go from this to auxiliary. Unless it's in the box and I can't see it, I don't think they give you that attachment anymore. But, brand new iPhone 11, ladies and gentlemen. Mm. I'm liking it, I'm loving it. I'd turn it on and show you, but honestly, it's just gonna look the exact same. You know it does, you know it will. I'm gonna be filming all day tomorrow with this thing, so make sure you tune in at 7 p.m. for my next daily vlog. I filmed every day of my life for the past four years. 
Now, using an iPhone, maybe one or two days with a different camera, but using an iPhone. So if you want to join me on my adventures, click the subscribe button, ding down the notification bell, and I will be giving you a full in-depth review tomorrow of this beautiful phone. So until then, enjoy my adventure from Milan to England. Even though it looks like someone drowned in here, I did not, but we need to go, because as per usual, I'm running late. But I welcome your face back to a new dawn and a new day. Uh, we need to be leaving this property because we've got a flight to catch and we are going home because Call of Duty, the beta, just went cross-platform, open, available for free for everyone. So uh, because I'm sponsored by Activision, I'm going home and playing video games all day. And the best thing is, I thought I was going to be hungover this morning, but I'm not, even that or I'm still drunk. Oh, and whoever the psychopath is, that like, took one person in the world to go, hmm, still water? Yeah, let's put bubbles in it. You're actually, ju you're, you're just a psychopath. Fizzy water is disgusting. It is the devil itself. Every time I'm in Europe and I open a bottle, because I, I can't be asked reading it like I'm in that much of a rush, I open it, it's a 50-50 chance whether it's going to be still or sparkling. And 99% of the time, I lose. So, the Hotel room, it has been a pleasure. Now, I don't know if you guys remember, but when I got at the airport and travelled to here, the taxi cost 90 euros. Ugh. Okay, taxi is en route to pick me up. Flight is at 2.55. Eh, we'll be alright. I've been waiting 20 minutes for this taxi. Oh dear. Checkpoint. Um, the one far away. Yeah, my flight's at 2.55, so I'm kind of pushing it. Wow, 255, we need to run. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you are very lucky you find me. If you... I am very lucky I find you. You seem to be driving fast already, I love it. If you find the taxi driver old, uh, you love the fly, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I'll tell you something, like, you've absolutely flown here. Like, you've got around every single car, like, I appreciate it a lot. Thank you. I hope I make it. <laughs> I hope I got to make it. Uh, I, I think... I think positive, so I think we'll, we've got this. This is the life. Think positive and everything was good. I like it. I like it a lot. I don't know if I'm uh, going to make it yet. I've got my boarding card. I'm going to try and I hope I'm at the right terminal. He said I am, so we'll find out. But yeah, that guy absolutely blew here. Like, blew. Okay, that's a good sign. Easy jet. Departures. <laughs> my flight, my flight is at 4:35. Oh bollocks! Breakfast is the most important meal of the day, and I've had absolutely none. I'm starting to get the shakes. I don't like getting the shakes. All right. Ooh. Right. So on the EasyJet app, it said uh, it closes at 2:35, but here it's saying three o'clock, and it's not boarding yet. <clears throat> E26. E26. Yes! Alright, I've made it through security. The problem is, I don't actually. Oh, wait. I filmed it. I was say, I can't remember what gate I'm at. E26. We are heading in the right direction. Okay, topping up on some Italian snacks. And that is the biggest Nutella pot I've ever seen. Oh my god, I just got denied my passport because of my passport picture. I was like, what do you mean? Like, why do you need another one? And then she just looked at me, he's like, driving license? Because I've got facial hair on my passport. She said that she didn't think it looked anything like me. What a But Milan, it has been incredible. Now, well, I'm the last one boarding, so get me on this plane and let's get home. It's lovely. Goodbye, Milan, Italy. It has been a pleasure. I do come back to Italy, though. My number one place I want to go is the Amalfi Coast. And I think that's where I may go very soon. Wow. Look at that. You can see all the mountains. Beautiful. Breaking Bad. Kinder Bueno, amazing view. The mountains in the background are crazy. Nice. No joke, I just looked out the window and I thought something was wrong with my eyes. Look at that.
what on earth is going on there? I have no idea where we are right now because we haven't got a screen. But look at that. That's well weird. And just like that, we're back in England. We're almost about to land. Not quite sure what that is. I think it's a quarry. <laughs> And you know what? The weather is not bad. Lovely. Manchester, holy shit. This is well nice weather. I love it. No checking, no bags for me. I'm going straight out. Sayonara, Manchester Airport. What a beautiful day to return back to England on. Like, it's absolutely gorgeous. And by the looks of things, I've got a friend at the house. Hello. Hey. <laughs> Oh, you shit hole. Okay, I didn't think you were going to do that to me. <sighs> Hi, Mum. <laughs> That's nice. Karen's staying at the house for a few days. <laughs> um, she, we're, we're, we're babysitting, oh, not babysitting, cat sitting Alice and Carl's cat. So, whilst they're away doing that, I was like, Mum, you might as well stay here rather than going all the way to where you live, all the way back, that sort of thing. Just come and crash here. So, that's what she's doing. Tomorrow is Friday, so it's Chris Ashcroft, um, Chris, no way Chris, um, his birthday, and I believe we're going down to Manchester celebrating, doing like a beer, j j like a, I was going to say beer fest, beer festival like Oktoberfest sort of, um, like German beer sort of drinking thing, so that's that situation. Saturday, probably a day of streaming, and then Sunday, it's my goddaughter Ariella's third birthday, so because it's a birthday, uh, we're having bouncy castle here at my house and everyone's coming around and stuff like that so I'm just like hosting the sort of venue space for the party so I'm really excited for it, it's going to be a good fun weekend so yeah I am though itching to play some Call of Duty so uh, I think I'm going to go get some food with my mum, come back and live stream Time for some payback ah! <laughs> The oh. rope fell off and he was wobbling for <laughs> Oh sorry cat Kitty Oh I've scared the cat, oh I'm so sorry Oh, doors open. no, the front door's open. No, 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 no. Stay there. Don't go outside. Don't go outside. Whatever you do, it's okay. No, no. Got him. Oh, my God. Don't you dare run off. Can't get in trouble with Alice. No way. You, you've got to win some award for, like, world's biggest cat, because you are gigantic. Look at the size of that unit. Mate, oh, I wonder where you're going. I guess the back door's open, yep, and he's going to sneak under the bed. Yep. <sighs> well, enjoy your stay. A lovely walk up to uh, the pub with our Karen for some food. Look at that for a view. What do you mean, our Karen? Hey, if, if you're staying with me, you're called our Karen. Oh, there's another house for sale. <laughs> I'm a fesh. I'm officially a fashion Easter. Fashion Easter. I've been to Milan Fashion Week. Darling, it was fabulous. Yeah, where he was Milan Fashion Week. Milan fa Milan Vogue. Yeah, Milan Milan Fashion Week, and I went to Milan Vogue's um, Vogue and Bulgari. Bulgari, Bulgari, what? I don't know. Yeah, I can't pronounce all these brands. <laughs> I only got, I only just knew how to pronounce that Gavanchi the other day. I kept calling it Gavinci. Cultured. Are you enjoying your little adventure? It's alright. <laughs> you said you wanted to walk. No, I do. Oh my god, I've got to film you just in case you fall. Oh damn it, you're being tactical. I thought you were just going to go straight up. Like this. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun, dun. This is steep. Did you not know I'm a, I'm a traveler of the world now? Whoa, look at this for a view. Beautiful. Fun story, by the way, to the gentleman, if you do happen to see this, I haven't actually uh, had a chance to reply to your letter yet, but on my bike ride the other day, uh, I was saying like, you know, looking for land, looking for land, and someone reached out to me. You saw the letter on the side. I didn't read it. Though. And they basically said, got some land just up the road from you that I'm gonna build a house on sort of thing, or looking to sell to build a house on or some sort of river like that. I was, I was in an actual rush oh, to get out of the door. Answer. But I was like, I like the idea. But I'm after land to not build a property on, like anytime soon. I want a land with a factory on, or I want just loads of land for me to do what I want with. Like imagine if I could have this, just at the top of my house. They mint. All right. There are them dodgy cows. What do you mean dodgy cows? What's wrong with them? Well, why are you calling them dodgy? Might... Stop looking at them funny. <laughs> You're exhausted. Yeah. She's poofed. <laughs> Let's get, oh my god, careful. Well, that's dangerous. No, 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 no. Stop, stop, stop. Go that way. Mum, it's boggy. You won't get past it. Oh my god, this is going to be hilarious. You ready? Yep. <laughs> oh, high five. Smashed it, well done.
and thus we find our holy grail at the end of our adventure, the hare and hounds. Somewhere isn't it? Look at the timing. Look at the location. A toast to uh, Happy Thursday. to a great success. Come to Thursday Club. Every day of the bloody week. Jesus. Mm. <laughs> I bumped into <laughs> Sam from Denton, and he's just got back from Magaluf. He's got a camel on his toe. Do you think you'll regret it when you're older? Never. I don't think you will, actually. I think My that's, kids will that's love pretty. It. You have kids? Not yet. Oh, God. <laughs> Dad's got something to show you. <laughs> I'll wait until you're older to explain. I love that you've got it in a carry case. Whoa. How old is she? Uh, three, four. Is she, right? Yeah. This was she. Whoa. Three years old. Whoa. It's always weird seeing another beard dragon. Is she, is she active? Oh, Steve now. Oh, Steve's five. Well, that's a. She's well alert. Hello. <laughs> yep, didn't expect to come out for a beer and now be holding. Look, it's a red bearded dragon. Whoa. Mate, Steve will be well jealous. Uh, no, Steve is a female. Uh, hey, yeah, whoa! I might have a friend for you. That was lovely, wasn't it? Honestly, it's exactly what I needed. And then look at this. Just walk over here to the most amazing sunset. Crazy! Oh my god! And this is why I love where I am. Just a magical, magical location. If you've never been here before, Hare and Hounds, T Cross, booming. That is crazy. That is the big Emirates plane that I had the shower on. Can we get? You've got a shower we on there. we can't get over the sky, can we? Every five seconds, it's just changing another shade, and it just looks magnificent. This is this is absolutely beautiful. There is another shade of colour here that is like blood red. Before it goes way too dark, I love that. I, I did like the food. It did go right through me though. I think it might have just been a bit too oily for my for my liking. So we're rushing home. <laughs> too much information, but look how how incredible is this? You like it? You're gonna be back local now. If you buy me the house. Oh yeah, I'll, if I buy the house, all right then. I told you I'd contribute. Okay. 50-50? No way, 99% 99 and, and 1. It's a deal. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> it's not even... <laughs> it's not much. Just, no, because I need my balance. Go on then. <laughs> Tom and Karen <laughs> walk home from the pub. Oh, too funny. Got the torch! 100% oh. <laughs> positive that that's a horse. So you made it out successfully. Yeah. Problem solved. We did it. <laughs> High five teamwork. <laughs> what? What? Who put my Yeezys in the freezer? Not me. I've been looking for them for ages. I was trying to take them to Milan with me. <laughs> they won't have any germs in them. Who the fuck? My shoes in the fridge. I said I'd get you a present from Italy. And what's the one thing Italy's famous for the most? Lemon Okay, I was going pretty sideways with this. Um, Ta da! <laughs> yeah, pizza. Oh, thank you. I thought that was a good one, right? I had no time to get you anything else, so. That's a really nice. Fruity. <laughs> I'm eating whiskey and cold and buggy. <laughs> yeah, pit. don't eat that, they're for granddad. Oh, I hope but yeah, do you like your present from Italy? I love my present from Italy. Boom, look at that. What a man. Me, me and my mum have just finished watching a binge of like 20 episodes of Still Game because we're going up to Scotland watching them, but. Is he. Oh! <laughs> the cat's just chilling on the windowsill. So look at him! <laughs> okay, looks kind of terrifying. You okay, buddy? Do you oh, miss your mum and dad? Just the as well. Right? <laughs> he loves it here. It's been a lovely end to my day, mum. Thank you for um, a lovely evening. Thank you. Yeah, no, I didn't expect to come back to come back to uh, England after being in Milan. I really thought I was going to feel like absolute pesh, <laughs> as, as the still game characters would say. I thought I was going to feel like absolute crap, but you know what? 
Came back, fresh as a daisy, weren't too tired. Managed to go out for food with my mum. It's been, uh, it's been actually rather lovely, so, yeah. Yeah, you're in the back spare room, is that all right? Oh, it's a motion sensor light, it just triggers sometimes. Oh, and if you stay to enjoy the vlog throughout, I say thank you. And I tell you what, you're gonna get a sneak peek of how good the wide angle lens is on the iPhone 11. Well, I've been hyping up this entire time to see how it is, rather than me filming and looking like I'm holding it here. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I get so much more room for activities. So much more room for activity. I, ca I can't believe how good it is. I'm doing my first day of vlogging with it in tomorrow's vlog. The unboxing bit I wanted to release uh, in this vlog that you just watched right now, simply because like, it came out today. If I put it out tomorrow, it just wouldn't make sense or anything like that. So in tomorrow's vlog, we're gonna be doing a full day from start to finish filming in 4K, 60 FPS. It's probably gonna blow up my computer and Orion's computer because the, fo the footage and size of files is just gonna be astro goddamn uh, And we may end up switching back to uh, 1080p, 60 FPS just for efficiency reasons and stuff but i'm gonna do a, do a full full 4k video section tomorrow and i hope you guys are looking forward to it so without further ado i'm gonna love you i'm gonna leave you